Hey all, Sarge here. Just letting you know, uh, I hit up a construction site house and got some sand, some concrete mix, a heap of stone, and I've got heaps of clay, but I'll show you where I've got that in a minute. Um, well, our food chest is doing well. Got a lot of water from when I was in the snow biome up by the trader. And got heaps of weaponry to use. Oh, I don't really need those arrows at the moment. Yeah. Uh, we've got 46 for the sniper rifle. And I went up to the fire station um, and cracked open the chests in there, the safes, and on my way through I looted and we got a couple new pistols, actually they're better quality pistols, so we'll grab one of them. Uh, I got a 45 with, oops, sorry, a 44 with two rounds, a few more 762, small pistol ammo, we'll throw them on board. More shotties, shot, sh shotgun shells from the buses. And all this was just miscellaneous. I've got the new fire axe from the fire station. And I got, there's more of this from another construction site. Can't remember where I got the iron from. This chunk of iron here. In the fire station, I got three, two wrenches, and two level one fire axes, so I scraped them, and a couple other things. But yeah, I thought I'd let you know. Oh. Sorry about that. And we're now, what are we? Level twenty-two. What? I've upgraded intellect so we can craft good quality items um, can do iron tools and weapons what else did I unlock um, healing factor I think I got ages ago ah, by the tier 3 or slot 3 pack meal um, can't remember when I got Skull Crusher, but we need to start looking at other options, which gun looting very shortly, dude. Uh, might as well grab that. But yeah, so we still got this wooden base. I've been planting trees, as you can tell, with the straight line. And I can't see you. And, yeah. But. I think I see it. I spent a few hours. Uh, I, see, I see it. I doing see everything. It. I see it. I see and then if we come along here, this is where I got my clay from. I started digging a pit. If you remember, it was just a short pit by uh, two by two, but now it's two by three. Uh, that's what I see. Uh, uh, yeah. What All I right. See. With all that said and done, I saw your big face. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. And got heaps of stones collected and turned them into cobblestones. Used some of the concrete for bam. This I here. Saw it. I saw it. So I spent a few hours just getting the outside done, as you can see. Yeah, that looks little. I've turned some of it into concrete on the third tier of cobble. Oh, Dan Kitten. Yeah, Right, what was I saying? Oh yeah, goes from that stage to that stage, the concrete stage. So you know, with all the trees I cut down, I put bikes, done some lawn care, and if we get round to the front, I've left this gap here, um, just so I can get in, 
Zombie skin. Yes, I know zombies can climb, dude. And it's just a big square hole at the moment. I haven't worked out what I'm actually doing. But it took a lot of cobblestone um, from all the little rocks. And there was a big one over there somewhere, if I remember rightly. So that's our horde base. And this is our backup horde base. This is my backup base, dude. So, if anything happens, we've got somewhere to hide on a horde night. Right, get back down I here. Think this like yep. yep. So, I've been just chilling back, turning most of this into concrete. Because we know what zombies are like for breaking through. Yeah, so I haven't done much um, apart from working on this because the next night's our horde night and I want to get semi prepared. As you can see, it's like cobblestone, and then brick, and I'll run out of cement. <laughs> But never mind, we will get there in the end. Oh, and get my big ass up here. Oh, oh, I'm glad I didn't break my leg then. I managed to not fall down the hole. Um, make a forge. Uh, I think it's in this one. So we can start making tools. But I'm thinking of putting it in over that side because I'm going to test a theory that the zombies go to the heat source, not the player source. Wire yes, it was a barbed wire. How did you do that? I found a barbed wire piece. I'll stick it oh. right there for now. And as you can tell. We got barbed wire wrapped around our metal club. That was in one of the loot um, boxes at the fire station. I say I want lunch. Yeah, well, you can wait a second, dude. So yeah, I thought I'd update you all. One of these days, I'm gonna jump off my platform and land either on my spike strips or something like that. Why? Because that's what always happens to Uncle. So yeah. So I'll be back in a couple of minutes, I'll just get the nephew a feed and we will go loot that building in front of us um, and see what I'm, because I'm pretty sure there's military grade stuff on the roof of that one, so, oh, take fall down the hole, so we'll find out, so I'll be back in a second. Alrighty, I'm back after sorting his lunch because I got him for the night so we'll probably be doing a live stream later on but right we need some food on good night my luck I'll get in the air and I'll be you are hungry you need oh, so need to move that right what food do we have we'll take some of that with us we'll take extra water Oh yeah, and I found a first aid kit as well, um, on the way to, um, what do you call it, the fire station, uh, miscellaneous, stick that in there, stick all that in there, we'll cut, take the, Feathers with us. Um, we should really need more than that. Got the shoddy shell. And the 
just took the shotgun shells and the knee because I don't think we'll need them at the moment. Right. <coughs> Alright, let's go. The reason that, that I put that there is I thought I'd square it off and have like a moat, but as you can tell, it's completely the opposite to what that is. And this dynamic weather is really annoying. But never mind. Um, front door for this. Well, raindrops.
Hey all, as you can see I've done a speed run to halfway through, well not even halfway through that area, but it's getting late, they started running, I got scared so we're back at base. So yeah, we'll have to finish that off on another day. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode, hopefully it wasn't too boring. Next episode should be a wee bit better. I'll have it more planned out. So yeah, have a good one. And we'll see you when we see you. Bye bye.